Yeshayahu, Isaiah 33. Woe to you that spoil, and you were not spoiled, and deal treacherously, and they dealt not treacherously, treacherously with you. When you shall cease to spoil, you shall be spoiled, and when you shall make an end to deal treacherously, they shall deal treacherously with you. O Yahuwah, be gracious unto us. We have waited for you. Be their arm, rather, be their arm every morning, our Yeshua, also in the time of trouble. At the noise of the tumult, the people fled. At the lifting up of yourself, the nations were scattered. And your spoil shall be gathered like the gathering of the caterpillar, as the running to and fro of locusts shall he run upon them. Yahuwah is exalted, for he dwells on high. He has filled Sion with judgment and righteousness and wisdom and knowledge shall be the stability of your times and strength of Yahshua. The fear of Yahuwah is his treasure. Behold, their valiant ones shall cry without. The ambassadors of peace shall weep bitterly. The highways lie waste. The wayfaring man ceases. He has broken the covenant. He has despised the cities. He regards no man. The earth mourns and languishes. Lebanon is ashamed and hewn down. Sharon is like a wilderness, and Bashan and Carmel shake off their fruits. Now will I rise, says Yahuwah. Now will I be exalted. Now will I lift up myself. Ye shall conceive chaff. Ye shall bring forth stubble. Your breath as fire shall devour you. And the people shall be as the burnings of lime. As thorns cut up shall they be burned in the fire. Hear ye that are far off what I have done, and ye that are near. Acknowledge my might. The sinners in Sion are afraid. Fearfulness has surprised the hypocrites. Who among us shall dwell with the devouring fire? Who among us shall dwell with everlasting burnings? He that walks righteously and speaks uprightly, he that despises the gain of oppressions, that shakes his hands from holding of bribes, that stops his ears from hearing of blood and shuts his eyes from seeing evil, he shall dwell on high. His place of defense shall be the munitions of rocks. Bread shall be given him. His waters shall be sure. Your eyes shall see the king in his beauty. They shall behold the land that is very far off. Your heart shall meditate terror. Where is the scribe? Where is the receiver? Where is he that counted at the towers? You shall not see at the fierce people, a people of a deeper speech than you can perceive, of a foreign tongue that you cannot understand. Look upon Sion, the city of our Somnites. Your eyes shall see Yerushalayim, a quiet habitation, a tabernacle that shall not be taken down. Not one of the stakes thereof shall ever be removed, neither shall any of the cords thereof be broken. But there the glorious Yahuwah will be unto us a place of broad rivers and streams, wherein shall go no galley with oars, neither shall gallant ship pass thereby. For Yahuwah is our judge. Yahuwah is our Torah giver. Yahuwah is our king. He will save us. Your tacklings are loosed. They could not well strengthen their mast. They could not spread the sail. 
Then is the prey of a great spoil divided. The lame take the prey. And the inhabitant shall not say, I am sick. The people that dwell therein shall be forgiven their iniquity.